What's up everyone, Seventh Beast and Test 2! This is NBA Playoffs on 2K Sports. The last part of the matchup, we're ready to find things out as we are ready to send you to Mile High where Denver Nuggets take on against the Golden State Warriors here at Ball Arena. The defending champion of the NBA title over against Miami Heat. But it's just a real game, but on 2K Sports against the Celtics. Now this part of the matchup, we are ready to do it again. Stephen Curry trying to look for his chance here because he's never been playing against the Denver Nuggets in the playoff the last time in just a couple of years since that one turned to be like it's a little chaotic on that game. But it may not be what they are looking for. They may not know what do they get if they have that one finishing the tightening of this game. But how could this happen if there's another choice to get it going? We'll find out, and <laughs> you may never know what it will be, because that might be a hard one that's going to come right after the game. You may never see what goes in. Now for the starting groups of the matchup, as the next commentators I have is OJ, along with Terry Crews, and then, of course, we have is Wood Spoonie, and your special guest of the game is Paintbrush. Well, as right now, here are the starting groups. We've got is Stephen Curry, Clay Thompson, Andrew Wiggins, Jonathan Kaminga, and Draymond Green. And for the Nuggets, we have is Jamal Murray, Contavious Carwell Pope, Michael Porter Jr., Aaron Gordon, and Nikola the Joker, all Jokic. Let's get going a mile high. Guys, all yours. See you later after this. An halftime show will be underway soon. Two K Sports welcomes you to the following presentation of the NBA Playoffs. It's all for everything. The Joker in Mile High and Golden State on the way next. Oh, it's illuminating here after the playoff night as Denver Nuggets are the defending champion on 2K Sports. Hi everybody, OJ here, and I'm also here with my sideline reporters with Pankbrush, also along with Terry Crews and Wood Spooning. As that one, David Aldridge on the sideline. The great matchups right in between are Jamal Murray and Stephen Curry, the key matchups in point guard. You know, the day is definitely what it calls for. They're ready to find out what they've got. And that one may be the day that can do it all for once. You know, I'm really excited because this is what we are ready for. Playoff mode. Oh yeah, I love playoff modes in between. I mean, this should be a great one. And hey, just expect it. And I know that one is going to be a great one matchup. Let's find out if they do. We start things up here for the quarter, all field and ready to go. Draymond Green, he's on Nikola Jokic. Following along with Aaron Gordon, he's with Andrew Wiggins. Then right from here is Jonathan Kaminga, he's with across here, Michael Porter Jr. Then it's Jokic, he's on it on the Palman, Carl Pope on Clay Thompson, and Jamal Murray on Stephen Curry. Here's the start. Gordon on the drive, looking in for the two. Take the first rebound will be Andrew Wiggins. First rebound will be putting in for the Golden State Warriors. Tries to find in the attacker over the two. It's denied by Gordon. Oh, Gordon had that one a lot of forceful to take. It may not be like an easier look, but hey, just don't try to take defender if you get that fun finished. Now here's the pass to Carwell Pope. He's a back again to Gordon. As you may already know, that said, Saturday puts him a win against the Atlanta the regular season. Aaron Gordon had never really got that one on just like he did. And it's just not really easy enough to say. I mean, whenever you can't make that one greetable, you have no other patient to do this. It's all what they don't do if they don't get that one finished tight. I mean, they've got to do some a lot of helping at this point. They don't have a lot of time to get that one over, but Atlanta Hawks seem not to be a great day for them. And Andrew Riggins, oh, what a go. This one starts off at the first point of the bucket, as right now Jamal Murray has one. Well, do you know the easier way to elevate yourself? I mean, you may not be thinking of what you're going to do. It's just no way to get that one defended. That's what they don't really do, just try to stick him up. 
Porter Jr. up, and a layup puts it in for two. Porter Jr. has his first bucket against the Warriors. Yeah, and best to say, Porter Jr. does have it all to keep that one strange in. Here's a shot, rejected by Jokic. First block of the game against the Golden State Warriors, and now he finds it again to Gordon. Now he has it over to get to Murray. Giving it over, now to Porter Jr. Jr. sidestep for two, and the first one delivers it, as their team puts up in a lead by two. While the defending one is having an easier way for Porter Jr., nothing compares if you get that one pointer right away because that one is a tight shotness to the corner, right toward the, the elbow and the and the pad. Sometimes it's not really always easy enough. I mean, you get that one a lot of hard at this point, you may have that one a hard feeling when you do it for him. I say easy enough to know for Porter Jr. He's been playing for one of his bets from University of Missouri. He knows he was able to do one of his trick techniques in there. Just don't get rid of him for sure. And for, of course, Jamal Murray, a Canadian player from Kentucky. It may not be just a lightning ball that you see. Well, just don't have to worry about anything. Just do what you can. And a drive puts in for Stephen Curry. And at first foul will call for the goal for Denver Nuggets as Stephen Curry's at the free throw line shooting two. This will be their first team foul for the mile high team. Now, you're not going to successfully get this one easy enough. All they say now is just not really what the press it does. To make that one stand out, you have to make sure you get that one going in. First trip to the free throw line will be the will be the Golden State Warriors. As he will have his first free throw. Add that, we'll put it in. And now here's Murray. He starts things off looking for his tightness and a scoring run. Now finds Gordon. Give it again to Murray. Outside, Porter Jr. Porter Jr. up for the two. Then it goes in. That one takes the first look. And to take that one with the first point of a lead. Oh, they say now, Michael Porter Jr. isn't the one that you go for it. Maybe that time must be going in there for sure. And I have no worries on that. Michael Porter Jr., what are you going to do now? Stephen Curry now having on Jamal Murray. Step back for the three. And that will sink it in from the outside. This will be a back-to-back -back switch as they're up by two. You know, that's what the Stephen Curry does to drive things for well. Always impossible possible to get that one. I'll go ahead for the three. You may not get that if you have that one shooting in at the right timing. Just go for that for sure. Alright, we'll pop up. Take that one back. Now has it over it again. Here's Porter Jr. Tries to leave it over. Now gives again to Murray. Here's another one for Gordon. Gordon on a step of a two. Rolling in and out. He's been listening to it too much right now, but I think his better place is better to be a rebound. Yeah, I, I know he, he wasn't able to do his first vertical rebound of the night. And it's not helpful enough, but you may not be getting this one at all. If that Porter Jr. does it so well, it's not what he does. Terrain this one place, can't let that one fool you. Here's a three for Murray. The three-pointer misses the target outside. Uh, I have no other questions what goes in now. They can't let that one get away with it. Switching screen, trying to help for Coach's concerns, now finding Curry. Curry, pushing inbound, over and good. Over by Carball Pope. And now the timeout call by the Denver Nuggets with under three minutes. Well, the start doesn't help that thing off. You know it doesn't really make that one feel untricky enough. You have to make sure you have it on your own. But that's what they always do. I mean, when they can't let that one fall pressure, they can't let that one scoring down. Because there is no other way they haven't got to make that one come in. That Golden State Warriors already beat against the Sacramento Kings the last postseason. It was definitely a hard one that they were taking. Yeah, you see the you see the different radiation here? Because that's what they all do. That's what they can't let them mess them up. And all that time, it's just not feeling like you really wanted to get this one over and under to. It, it's just not what the way that they wanted to play for. And you gotta make sure you get that when you're done as soon as you can. 
if something doesn't happen, you may not know what could be. That could be a hard one, and no one will get there. As a new substitution appears, it's right now a couple players have checked out and a couple players checked in. All five players are out of the court. Sarge, Looney, Peyton, and Paul are checked in. As the other one, Stroppers checked in along with Watson, then Ricky Jackson, then Braun, and Nergy. Here's Ricky Jackson wanting to go scoring over Paul, and he has that first drive in. Start things up here with a 12 8 score in the first period. Now, you can't let that one mess over you. If you do that once away, you know Reggie Jackson can definitely try to get the scores in. Oh, what a drive here for Curry! An assistant puts up by Chris Paul. Now, that's what they do for this offense. It's gotten pretty good, but don't let that one be fought around. And now the pass to Najee. Najee now finds again to Braun. With only two minutes remaining, he finds Jackson. Now has it again to Najee. Najee, over and under. That one starts up here. That one takes the first goal ahead and make that one go in to make that shot. That's what you do with the first game. It just comes in for Najee that that happened to be like him. Ludi has that rebound and that put in the back in the other way. And now he's Reggie Jackson. Now finds it over to Braun. Braun now again to Stroffer. Stroffer trying to go in. Gives it now to Jackson. Now finds again to Stroffer. Stroffer over now. Najee with the setback. And that puts in another two pointer for Najee. You know, easier way does for Najee. Gets that one a good chance. Might be a one tough way to you go with the basket cow. CP3 covered up by Jackson. Now finding Looney again to Sarich. Watson on in. Curry for three. Sinks it in for the triple. As the first, first three pointer puts in, a Sarich with the assist. And Ricky Jackson will have his own time. Now giving again over to Stroffer. Here's a three. Two for Braun. And good. Raging in right now, back down by five. He has his first bucket of the night. Chris Bryan really might show him what he does. But I guess that just happened to be like, okay, I get it. So you can definitely try to leave it off with the pointer. All saves for go, they made that one changeable again. After the last touch here by the Golden State Warriors, that's right now as Ricky Jackson will turn things over and will be now a Nuggets ball. Here's a pass off to Braun. Braun, give again to Jackson. Now finds Strucker. Losing the ball. And back again to Watson. Watson for the two. And that one rolls in the net. They can't let that one be four and over. And there is no way that they can definitely try to like save it off again. And that layup will roll it in. That one starts it up and they can't let that one go right in between. It goes over and out. Jackson from half court. And it went short as it will end the first quarter here. 21 to 14 to score. Not going to be the Warriors to start things off, but that one may not be challenging. We'll get to the second quarter after this. And as you're turning in for the second period, we get this thing started right now, as the Warriors are already have that one crushing in in the first period. Now as a take right now for Warriors, they really are trying to answer that one. That was a 2022 NBA champions, but 2023 happened to be the season seven winner. It may not be what they call it, but they just can't let that one stop for. Yeah, and there's one way that must have been like an odd switch in between. The odd even numbers are, are going to be a lot that hard to go right in between for those. I have a lot of range about them. They might be taking it in at all the time. They may not be doing what they really have, but as you only know, Skip can take this combo boot, and that one with a great pointer might be taking it up for some reasons. It may not be what you're just talking for, but 
hopefully, there might be a change even that they're going to get that one over and done. Yeah, see, veins. I, it's just a clear way to make that one precise enough. That may be one way that you can get that one up and living. Hopefully, that might keep on going so. Here's a look for Jamal Murray after a bucket made by CP3. And a three for Porter Jr. Able to answer the rebound, and Jokic will pick it up. Now his first bucket in the, in the number four rebound of the game. He's really like calling to rebounds. I'm saying that he's one of the biggest guys. Called him the Joker for sure. Fade away on the shot, no good. Four. Draymond Green now finding it again to Murray. Murray now gives the Jokic. Fade the shot. Now finding it again over to Porter Jr. Gives now again to Carwell Poe. We do have a reporter for David Aldridge. He has talked to one of it as Mike Malone is the head coach for the Denver Nuggets. While Steve Kerr was getting a lot of it in between of his suggestions, that might be a pickup on the way. How did that really turn to be like them? It may not be what you want, but that's what that one changes over. Yeah, the same thing that I can definitely tell you. Because there was no other way that they can let that one stop him by. And I just had, I would know that for sure. It's just not clear enough, and you don't have to make that one too hard of it for some reason. It's what no one does, and it's not what they, you play for. you got to know what they've done. Each coaches has to go in between. Whoa, what a layup by Aaron Gordon. Oh, he's having a smooth mark. That was a smoothing drive, and that's when you can finish it up the scoop in. whoop de scoop the scores Now he's committed to it. Now find Wiggins. Wiggins trying to, try to pull the attack. Find Green, and that one goes in, assisted by Wiggins. He has his first assist here of a night with just under 5.30 to go. Denver trailing by 7. Jokic, oh, wants to go with that one. And a 3 for Porter Jr. Grab and rebound, miss. Murray, off for the 3, and that one goes in. Jamal Murray had the first three point and now Gase is in for the next. It's just clear and Stephen Curry just seen that. Okay, I'll give that credit to them. Let's see if he can take it again. Jokic grabs the rebound with a miss from Golden State. That's his sixth rebound of the night. Now give it again to Murray. They finish the drive. He's fouled. CP3 with his first personal. And that'll be the first team foul for Golden State. Now for Jamal Murray, he might that one step in. He wants to elevate. Mm. Elevate for sure. Might be just coming in. Maybe he does for sure. I want to see what he can do if he gets it again. The first trip to the free throw line will be the Denver Nuggets. And it will stop the play with under 4.50 to go. And he hits the first free throw. Just say about, you know, the point guarding of this blue arrow does happen to be like for Jamal Murray. Have to be like what you call for. Never really happened, but unless he does for everything for himself to give that one clear room. Well, I'll say this because elevating is a key. Most times that Jamal Murray definitely is just speaking to the head coach for sure. He might be stepping in there. He goes, all I do is to elevate the process. And this is what my team really needs. And they know about me, Blue Arrow is the key to be successful at the range. And sometimes doesn't help for one of them's appearance. I'll see if I can do more. That's key smart. Time out called by Golden State Warriors with only 4.41 to go in the first half of the period. As we look over into the part of the schedule here for tomorrow night, Game 2 is wrapping in right now as we have the first game coming underway. That will be the Cavaliers facing against the Detroit, sorry, Indiana Pacers. That will be happening here at Cleveland, Ohio with the first game here at 12.30 p.m. Following along with the next game as we kick things off here for 4.30 game. That will be, you all named it, that will be 5.30, of course. That one will be LA Clippers and the Dallas Mavericks. There's a nice game at 7.30 p.m. It all says Magic 
redo it again to face against the New York Knicks. And finally, the last game here at 9.30 p.m. again. This one goes back to another Golden State versus Denver Nuggets. Well, you see, that's when I can get that one a good handle off to. Maybe it might be a one day for an all time. And I love switching things up if that one goes in cool. Just as smooth as it gets. Now you sign now, two for it, smooth on the bottom. <laughs> Boys, this really made that one feel like I'm hungry for more. Maybe I want something. Give me some more. As we look into the static right now for the Golden State, as for the Nuggets, they have the fast break points since the All-Star game. They're in fourth place. Well, All-Star breaks can't let that happen with fast break points if they get that one coming in. Maybe there might be another way of changing in the room, but we may not know what will they change it off to. Rebound puts in for Aaron Gordon. These guys, third rebound, not gives to Murray. Now Murray wants to sidestep it, he finds Gordon, and Gordon does it again. That's his second bucket, and Murray with the assist. That's a great communication in there. Might be ticking it in as he got. CP3 on Jamal Murray. To three, did I by Joker? That's Jokic with his first second block of the game. Oh, just don't say that. Jokic couldn't believe that. That's what turned to be like it's a terrific for a successful range if he puts it the night on green. With the two, it's Jokic. Good. This one starts dying and now gets the lead off as he has his second bucket. Now here's Paul. Try to step over to Green. He gives it to Kamiga. Kamiga watching on him. Looks for the cutter for Paul. Five to shoot. Over Jokic. Now rolls in and out. And a last touch by Jokic and will stay with the Warriors ball. Now with a new substitution as a couple players are checked out as now Curry and Looney are checked back in. As for the Denver Nuggets, Carball Post checked out, and now checking back in is Chris Braun. Three for Curry. Can hit that one to fly as it goes with a number missed by the Golden State Warriors. Here's Braun, now finding it again to Gordon. Gordon now swings it, it's stolen by Looney. Thompson, now here he goes. And it goes to Wiggins. That one just takes it over, and now Jokic with the ball. We're going to get back again to Jokic. Gives it now to Braun. Bounce pass to Jokic. Fade off with the shot, and that one sticks it in. Jokic with his six points in the game, and now it's just a 32-28 game, up by four. Yeah, well, they just really making that one feel good. Keep on proud. A stronger, the better, and the try best cup. Timeout called by Golden State Warriors with only 2.31 to go. We're nearing down to the end of the first half as we got a halftime report coming up. We have is Ernie Johnson, Kenny the Jet Smith, and of course Shaq O'Neal for the, the team scouts of the Warriors and the Nuggets. There will be every day what you call for coming up after this. And if you say, if you have some tickets here, we still got you covered right now, as there's going to be a lot of them to take all of it at the college out there. You know what does happen? I know of Chicago. Because that might be a great place to go check it out. You don't want to miss that one out there. If you're still in it, you've got to see one of the shows. And we are so sorry to hear now, because all the tickets one year in New York, and the other one year that goes with, you all called it for today. As we've got it in between of uh, the Sundays, we still have some couple tickets left, and they're all running out. So, what are you waiting for? Don't miss that one out. Go to amazandy.com slash tickets, and you'll be able to get into the next one before they're gone. New substitution on the court, as right now the Warriors are adding another new changeoff, as Gary Payton II checking in for Wiggins. And Sarge just checked in for Jonathan Kaminga. Ball stolen by Braun, and now he finds it over. Murray to finish. Oh, what a drive. Jamal Murray, seven points as Braun picks up the steal. The first turnover turns to be Golden State. While the problem now, you never blocked that one to get away with it. 
That's because he's been uh, like trying to open the gap out here. Yeah. But he was close enough. He was ready to take a steal and said, "Who are you gone? What are you looking for?" Never really got that one. Trying to stick it out. The first foul is called on Ricky Jackson. That will be his first personal. And another team foul called on Denver. Clay Thompson at the free throw line shooting two with only 2.14 left. And he hits a free throw down. Second one is good for Clay Thompson. Let's then make that one to say for Clay Thompson, he's still not trying to like leave his team behind. I know he's trying to just try to keep it all what he's got. It's not what you always do. I mean, just show him what you care for. Don't let that one get away with that one in between. Here's Jackson on a finishing drive. A good stop here as now he has that rebound. We'll have to clear it out before the three seconds call. Just five to shoot. Najee for the two. And good! Reach in there for three. And he has it over to Jamal Murray. Well, you, you got that one threes. I mean, if you're over not stepping on a three-point line, I mean, you're lucky now. But if you're on a three-point line, you still have a two. Now, Piggin. Find again. And Looney up with a good pass by Gary Piggy in a second. As that one comes back to digit down by five. Well, it's easy now. I mean, they may not be knowing anything before. I mean, they never deserve that trust right in this moment. They need to get that one a lot harder. They need to give them some, a little bit change off to get that one placed down. Bounce pass finds Jokic. Five and a shot clock. Up at the two and uh, goes in with the tip in. Jokic with eight points, and it's Braun with the assist. Well, you see what now happens? Jokic trying to feel the fingertip roll out of him. Hey, all what you care for. Yasid Dari. And a rebound will put it up here for Looney, and now get back to Curry. Curry trying to look over now for three. Then swishing in has missed the target. Now he finds again to Braun. Braun now over again to Jokic with 30 seconds. The bounce pass finds Jackson. Jackson gives again to Jokic. Three for Braun. Six to triple. Jokic with the, with the assist, and Braun's got five points. Well, Braun, I mean, made that one feel good. I mean, go with three-pointer. I mean, you got it all. They will let the clock wind down, as right now, Curry was over on Murray. And it's finishing. Up to fade it. And that one rolls in and out. And a rebound. It's off the rim. That ends 42-32 as they're up by 10. And some time now to send you over to David Aldridge on the court side. Hey, Dave. Kevin here with Contagious Caldwell Pope. And Contagious, you guys were getting a lot of offensive rebounds in the first half. How important was that? I mean, that is important, man. We got to keep them on the glass. Um, we can't get them side to side now. We got our offensive rebound too well. Get us on the side to side basket. Just keep working hard. Well, you made it work in the first half, KCP. Thanks a lot. Back to you, Kevin. All right, David. See you all later for the third quarter. Halftime is now on. The 2K Sports Halftime Show. Welcome back, everybody. This home crowd is elated about what they've seen so far. I'm Ernie Johnson. That's Shaquille O'Neal. That's Kenny Smith. Some struggles for Denver in the first quarter. They struggled to find an offensive rhythm or come up with enough stops and sunk into a seven-point hole by the end of the period. They had a massive shift, though, as they flipped a switch in the second quarter and began to take charge of the game and now have a ten-point lead. What a turn of events. Jack, what's your take on this? They've really established themselves in the glass. Me and Dom are there as my extra possessions, which they've cashed in on. Now we just got to, you know, bring the same energy to the second half. And Kenny, how'd you think the Warriors were playing? Well, they have to get deeper. Guys were getting burned on the perimeter. They wouldn't put a hand up, as my man used to say, hand down, man down. Oh, you got to get him some help. That pretty much covers everything. Shot. You think they played their best? 
going away. And now with the second half about to get underway, let's send you back courtside. See you, everybody, with Kevin Hart. You've been watching the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Hey, we're happy enough to have you back in Mile High as he's about to get underway in the third quarter. Same about Stephen Curry. He has been trying to smoke it out in the first quarter, but he's looking to get that one done in the second half. This may not be what the day is, but what do you say about him? Is he a legendary or what? Well... I don't know if he is, but a legendary is not always a worthwhile thing because of that, it doesn't happen to be improvable. I may not know if this one may have to be the guest or not. Well, let's find out if he is. Well, let's find out what you gotta do, Stephen Curry, because there's a lot of a legendary that can try and like keep on going. Yes, indeed. Wrong with the start. Oh, I think he must have pushed somebody out. Gotta give that one a payback says, hey, what you doing? Curry on Murray. Murray and I'm Wiggins on Porter Jr. Try to step it now. Three for Thompson. Sinking triple no good. Another miss by the Golden State Warriors as they have not been scoring in between the last two ten per minutes of the game in each period. Well, sometimes it doesn't help at all. Sometimes this one gives that one too soon. And this is not good. No choice. Can't let that one get over it. The three for Porter Jr. Six to triple in. Has that one with 12 points in this game. Tall, high, made that one go in. Yes, it's easier enough now. Michael Porter Jr. does it again. Deuce Wiggins. Trying to step in, looking for a drive, now finding over. Outside Curry for three. The triple range, no good. Oh, they're losing it again. I mean, not the easy way to type. Here's Porter Jr. now finding it over again to Carwell Pope. The bounce pass to Gordon. Gordon, right around Brian, around Green. Oh, what do you know about that? The wraparound shot and made it in. I've seen that before. I mean, can't let that one stop you. Oh, man, Bron. I don't know what you're going to do. Don't take it too much seriously. And this rebound puts it in. Fighting for the rebound. This one goes back but again here as Wiggins will have another two-pointer. And now Murray will have it. So far, he's only scored a couple of them in the first half. But the second half, he wants it again. And now he finds it to Carwell Pope. It's a reporter for David Aldrich. He's been talking with his head coach, of Steve Kerr. Because most of the time, it doesn't happen to me most of them because Stephen Curry hasn't really got into it again. And he's been losing one of them. And they said, we have got to keep attacking him. It's no way to get that one stopping down. We have no idea what we're doing, but we need our help there, guys. There's a lot of forcing, forcing rebounds over and under again. Yeah, and the thing about that is what the rebound puts in, your timing doesn't really mention that whenever you get up with a good rebound, you make sure you get it clear on that one. If you don't get this one in time, you're going to have a hard one, and you're not going to get this one finished off properly. And that one's going to be turning it over, to have the hard rebound take out. When you're playing with the Golden State Warriors or the Denver Nuggets, you make sure you get the cover rebound. Three for Curry, and he does it again. Another three-pointer drops him by, a 51-37 game. Well, he's been waiting patiently for now. Gotta keep that one going. Yeah, I know, hard one is never gonna take a work out of it. Carwell Pope, on Clay Thompson, he finds it now to Braun. Braun gives a bounce pass to Gordon. Over with a shot, and the layup is unable to connect. Curry gives again to Wiggins. Wiggins now finds Curry. Over with the three, and whoa, that one almost made it out, but stayed in the rim, and that adds another three-pointer for Stephen Curry. Mm, take out with triple threes. I mean, do you want back-to-back -back threes? Okay, I'll do it again. And he does that one. 
once more. It's not what they always say of. <laughs> you never wanted to get the threes. I mean, just keep climbing back. Talk about Cole by the goal by Denver Dodgers with under four minutes remaining in the third. The NBA playoffs on 2K Sports is brought to you by Sour Patch Kids. Sweet, sour, gone. American Express. Don't live life without it. And by State Farm. Like a good neighbor, State Farm is there. As we head your way down into the NHL, we've got some next couple of games. As right now, the first game is will be happening here. For the second and third seed, this will be starting things off. We're on the right side of it. We get this thing started off here as we will have the first game as the Hurricanes battle against the Flyers here at Philadelphia at Wells Fargo Center. Following along with the next game as we've got another one for you. But uh, for the second and third seed, the Oilers against the Golden Knights at T-Mobile Arena. Then following along with the next part of the game, is the one versus the, the wild card C team as the Rangers battle against the Tampa Bay Bolts or the Lightning at Amalia Arena. And finally, all I'll say now is there could be one game Vancouver Canucks face against the Los Angeles Kings at Crypto.com Arena. And the next game will happen to be Currents as to start with the first game in Nashville against the Dallas Stars. That's all right here, only on Son of Beast. Be sure to subscribe to this channel because we have a lot more to cover it all ahead. If you don't, somebody will. After the bucket made miss, here's Porter Jr. now finds Jackson. He Jackson now finds it to Watson. Watson gives over to Jackson and now he finds again to Strawford. Strawford to cut it bound. That player can't finish it off. Well, there's a double demand defenders out there. I mean, there's going to be a lot of changes if you can't get that going. And what a slam down for Pat Braden Wazemski. That's what he does now because Wazemski just really have to show, show up with this pride. I mean, what's the use for you? You may not get that one out there. Right, Tommy. Now he finds the pass over to Watson. Watson gives over to Schroeder. Shopper, up with two, and good! Make it in there for the first bucket of the Paris game in game one. 55 42 is the score, we've under 230. on Jackson. Screen in for Kaminga. Ball's loose, and stolen by Jackson. Oh, here they come, gonna be a tall tight one in, and Watson will finish it off here. He finally has his first bucket. And this one puts a number assist here for the Denver Duggets. Well, now that's when you go in by. That secondary lineup changeup is not always doing good. The CP3's got to do something else. Oh, what a rejection by Gordon. Oh, what the way is for Gordon. Must know it to deny that shot. What a nugget run performance. Now finds Porter Jr. Warrior Jr. now skips it over. Chopper for three. Triple range. Rolls in and out. Oh, he would have almost made that three impossible, but that score's not going to go and keep on going if he makes it. Rosinski grabs the screen. Up for two, and he's fouled. Schroffer has his first personal, and that'll be their first team foul for Denver Nuggets with under 90 seconds in the third period. Well, that's what they do because Brady Pazinski just really can't let that one afford it. He's been really all over this point. That is a hard brutal to take out. And not when you're just going to take the defensive in there, but don't let that one come for the worst. And free throw misses it. With another new line substitution, all has three players checked out. Wiggins, Kamega, Green. Two players checked out. Bayer moves over as Sarge and Looney are check in. The Nuggets are also making new changes as Porter Jr. and Gordon moves over to point forward and Nikola Jokic back in. And he missed the second. 
Oh, that's what they don't really do. He means he's really tired out there. I don't think he doesn't want to play at this one in the secondary group. Sometimes his playoff just went doesn't cut it in for him. Yeah, it's a big problem out there. No even a choice. Uh, and the rookie players, they may not be showing what they care for. Not when you do all your work. Step back two. This is again as Jokic has an award. Jokic picking it up is a re rebound number 10, and he now has it over to Schroffer. Back to Jokic. Try to go up. And it's it taking rebound by Looney. Looney with an over rebound and now finds it again to CP3. Chris Paul. Chris Paul trying to spread out the room. Looney finds Sarge. Holding cover here, now find Wazimski. Five to shoot for the Warriors. Slide it in up across to lay it up. No good. And another rebound puts in for the Nuggets. Watch these guys first rebound with only 15 seconds. Now finds again to Strawford. Strawford now finding it over. He finds again to Watson. Watson. Up in the layup. And good. Watson with his second bucket of a night. The appearance is nowhere recent. That may be the finishing drive he does. And that ends the third period. 59 42 to score. It looks like it's been a wild night for a wild lie. And Paintbrush, thanks for coming in for the game. We'll see you all for the next couple of games in between. Yeah, thanks you guys. It's been a really appreciation. I hope you all enjoyed the fourth quarter. And we'll see you guys, guys again next time. This is all what happens. Keep the playing drought, keep it alive. Full court is coming up next after the break. You're watching the NBA playoffs on 2K Sports. And we have a moment to reveal your State Farm assist of the game. You know, Asia does have it to say now for Golden State Warriors, but the Nuggets seem to be doing the trick for Jokic on just what he did. He just made that one cut in motion, thanks to Braun. He's been excellent to keep that alive. Seriously now, well done for again. The bench points delivers it. Three quarters are finished, but now this is the final quarter. I ain't mile high. Ready to get this done. Chris Braun, he's with Clay Thompson. Vance Carwell Pope, he's on Stephen Curry. Jamal Murray on CP3 of Chris Paul. Manaji is on Jonathan Kamingo. And Jokic, he's on Kevon Looney. Curry for three. Biting the three, doesn't hit the mark in. That's really gonna be a hard one to take, but not your time to be lucky enough. Naji has it over now with the dish off. He gives it up and over again to, to Jokic. Up with two and he's fouled. Clay Thompson got another piece of it, but he got fouled already. Yeah, it might be one changing, and it's not the why you do. You don't mess up the Joker. Another free throw coming up here for the Denver Nuggets. There's Jokic at the free throw line, shooting two. The probability of this one had to be Nikola Jokic's playing step by step career in motion. The hard drive doesn't seem to be worthwhile after playing in the uh, different league in the regions. This might have been a one way occasionally that could definitely change it all. For some other facts, I say that Jokic has been one of the best players in this game. He is the legend of player for Nuggets. Give that one, sure. Chris Paul is checked out as Andrew Wiggins is checked back in. The Nuggets are also making new changes as now Najee's checked out and Michael Porter Jr. back in. And he adds it number one with the free throw. He has 10 points with 7.23 to go. Stephen Curry trying to fill it out a little bit. Now with the screen, held by Looney. Finds it to Looney. Oh, what a dunk! And Curry with the assist. Yep, that's what happened. That wasn't going to be a scoring breakdown, but the bench by nine seemed to be okay for that. But I don't think that's not going to help like that. You don't want that. No, no, why? Carl Pope tried to feel it out a little bit. Finally again to Porter Jr. And what a pass by Carl Pope. Michael Porter Jr. has got 14 points in the game. Now here's Curry. Or driving right now and finally looking for Thompson. 
Williams on Braun. Braun with the step back. The two doesn't hit it off that point, and he gets back to Porter Jr. to Murray. Here's Murray trying to have it over now again to Porter Jr. He swings it now, finding to Murray. Murray trying to give it over now again to Corbo Pope. Five on the shot clock. Braun, three for Murray. Sinking triple, won't sink in. Back to Murray. A lot of good ball movements for the Denver Nuggets. Six on the shot clock. Here's the shot. Porter Jr. scoops the drive. Has 16 points and he's been fancy. I'm <laughs> just the way you look for. Michael Porter Jr. What a finish, Mike. Now he finds the pass to Curry for two. And that will do it here instead of the threes. It's now a 65-46 game. Curry's got 21 points in this game with 18 minutes on the court. But this one didn't catch him up with his, for this field goal range as that went under. Watching out cold, here's Broad. Now helps it again. Ball's tipped. Now finding again a Corbo pull. Here's another one. Murray for two. And no shot here. That's another miss by Jamal Murray. Uh, that's not going to happen now because Jamal Murray is missing in many of them. But I think his better position is to be the point guarding of a action. It doesn't happen. One way goes with another takeover with the drive and not really happening what they get there true. As he makes another two pointer, he now finds it again to Murray. Now Braun has it. Has a bounce pass. Ball's loose. Porter Jr.'s got to recover. Braun. Here's Murray. Up to the three again. This time, no. Jokic up. Oh, what a take here. Jokic got 12 points. And 11th rebound of the night seemed to go for the new player of the game. And here's Looney up with that shot. Tips it in. Curry with the assist with 67-15 game. Now with a full time to remain in the fourth quarter. Here's another one for Carwell Pope. That ball slip, and it's stolen by Curry. Well, it's another bad changeup, and you never wanted to steal it over. That's because Stephen Curry is just trying to help it out, get back into work, and get a close game in between. Well, it's not what they really were saying in the court. All you need to do, do is try hard, get this done. Jokic with a step back. That's good for two. As he picks up another two pointer, as Jokic has 14. You know, they say that Jokic has it done. It's just a step back, make The Joker can't let that one stop down. To me, go up. And that two will stick it in with another timeout ball by mile high of Denver Nuggets. 3.24 left to go in the fourth quarter. And we'll get a sidetrack here. We'll stick, take a step side as you will have another one coming in. While well, saying for now, Jokic, you're on the fire media. May have it all what you believe in. Now with a new substitution, let's check out our new New Balance player of the game, Nikola Jokic. Now you wait you say this. Nikola Jokic got that one with a great on-stopping play. This inbound does it all, and he's been one of the best. Easy to sign now, but Jokic is one of the biggest. After being with the finals MVP, now he wants to see if he does it again. Here's Murray. Find now the continuous Carmel Pope. Back outside, gives again to Boyer Jr. Boyer Jr. now finds Murray. He's up for the two. The rebound puts for Jokic. Carwell Pope does it again. Now find Murray. Watching screen here. Gives to Jokic on a pass. What a take here. Jokic a 16 and Murray with the assist. Now they say what Jokic does. Finish it. Try. Do it all what you can. Now back again to Curry. Murray on the top of him. And now Kaminga is on Gordon. Guarding him. Back pass. Almost broken up. Wiggins now find Curry. For the two. Another miss by Golden State. Well, that one is really like a hard one of tanking in this 
nothing pressurizing, and this one keeps on attacking, and they never really wanted to finish that one off. No, that one, the cur cutting down is not really the optional to take on this time. The bounce pass sign, Jokic. Step up, two again! Oh my! Jokic with 18 points, and now with two minutes remaining, it's a 73 52 game. Oh man, they're on fire already. May never know how to stop it. And Carl Clay Thompson gives that one a three point ahead, and now has to go ahead and shot. He finally has someone coming in back. Murray now finds Forward Jr. Forward Jr. gets again to Murray. Murray now has it over now again to Gordon. He gives it again. Murray on the inside. Set for two. And good. Murray does it now again. The second to last timeout will be called by Golden State Warriors with 90 seconds in the regulation period. That playoff does it all. I think the Rocky and team calls for Nugget playoff mode. They just really love to hear that one scream out. That's what they can't really say for, for one of each. I mean, show them what you have for Spectrum. Do it all you can. If you really like the last part of your game, you can check out the NBA postseason playlist. You, it's on right down here, so you can click up there in the calling card. That will take you right in between. From the start of season four, right here to the current season, you're right ahead. It's one of the best plays right now. I mean, you won't have to worry about it by going right to scroll it over. So the playlist is on, out, and ready to find its way for another new postseason. And it's always excitement that everybody loves. So you can watch it here, link up in the calling card. Substitution on the court as some changes on for the Golden State Warriors. As a couple players are checking in and a couple players checking out. And for Gordon now checking in for Braun. Thompson spins around all around Porter Jr. For two. It's good. Now he's Murray who will have his time. Let the clock roll down as they will get their Denver first win of the game against the Golden State. And now he finds it to Porter Jr. 10 seconds in the shot clock. Here's another take. Murray for three. Kaboom! That one outside with 14 points. And they already been killing it off. Yeah, they say it's just what they have done. Jamal Murray, a pressure blue arrow team. Sarich on Gordon, and he's offensive foul. There's like a quick chop, and there's a changing turnover as it goes over to Denver. As right now, the all starting groups are checked out as four players checked in for the Denver Nuggets. Brady Jackson now gives it again to Watson. Keep the clock winding down, now find Strawford. And here now again to Jackson. I think he wants some more. Up again, and good! Brady Jackson with the second bucket. Well, that first half just got a pretty good start. But now he definitely wants to say, okay, who wants this? Because I want that bucket in me. Oh, what a block made! And that turned it over to the Nuggets ball. Wow, <laughs> not a choice at all. You made that one clear enough. That's another big block by Watson. Wow. As Ronaldo CP3 checked in with 20 seconds. And Jackson will let the clock wind down as they will get a wraparound win in Mile High. Final score is 80 to 57. And he'll be back home, ready to do it again for tomorrow night's game. Here to do it back at Mile High. And we'll be at for Mile High at 9.30 p.m. again. And that will be all for everybody. Well, I guess they're all celebrating now. Let's win. Let's go celebrate early. Yeah, that's what they all do. They just keep on doing to have it all bring out with the win. And it's time now to send you over to court side as David Aldridge stands by with the player of the game. Hey, David. Thanks, guys. Aaron, big night offensively. What is clicking for everyone right now? Push, move the ball. Move the ball. 
guys a, a big part of our offense, making sure the ball doesn't stick, and then people making shots. It was really flowing tonight, man. Congrats on the win. Back to you. All right, David, thank you. And I will wrap it up in my heart with me, OJ, along with the special guest of Paintbrush and Terry Cruz and Wood Spoonie. This has been a presentation of the NBA playoffs on 2K Sports. Thanks for tuning in, and we'll see you all again for the next games. Good night in my heart, everybody. All right, OJ, thank you so much. And what a big win here for a mile high team as Denver Nuggets are back in for the team champion back in for the next one. Yeah, it's pretty much clear now. I mean, whenever they call for one of them between, I mean, they've really done their best. I know the Golden State Warriors have a little bit of difficulty, but I'll say it's gone leaky. That's what Denver Nuggets made that win. <laughs> My, I know what they all say. Rocky Mountains, they are always near for the live to bring on successful. Here's how they did with the total statistics. 60% for the field goals for Denver. And it was 6-6 six six for 43 over 38 for the Golden State and Nuggets was even up. Three throws was perfect for the, Gold, for the Denver Nuggets, but only two had missed. That seemed to be, you know, Braden Bozemski, because he never had that one free throw early enough, and he never got that one in time. Fast break points was only eight for Golden State Warriors, but everything was clucked in, all for points in paint, second chance point, Bench points, assists, offensive defensive rebounds, steals, blocks, and turnovers. That was everything in between for Denver Nuggets. They've been on fire already in between for the first quarter, second quarter, third quarter, and yeah, fourth quarter, you get that one, all of it in between. Yeah, sometimes do. I mean, can't really say that one for now. Two team fouls was given for Golden State Warriors. And it was four dunks for Golden State Warriors, but nothing for Denver Nuggets, sadly. But that one biggest lead was 23 for Denver Nuggets, and time possession was 18-24. Now, let's send you over to you, Test Tube, for three star players of the game. All right, thank you so much. Time for three star players of the game. The third star starts off here. We go right in between the, the one way to another. Michael Porter Jr. with 16 points, and he has done three rebounds, one assist, one steal, seven out of ten field goals, two three-pointers out of five, and it was 18 performances on his effort, taking with his time, motion, and all to give a go at pickoff play. Now for number two. The New Balance player of the game seemed to be a lot of them, but Nikola Jokic just done it again. 18 points, 1 block, 1 steal, 1 assist, and 12 rebounds. 8 out of 9 field goal range, and it was 21 performance effort. Does all great thing happens. And for your number 1 star, well, I guess it must happen now. I mean, for Golden State, well, you know now, it's nobody. That must have meant that Golden State Warriors brought Stephen Curry in with 23 points. And it looks like he's just crushing it in with some... Great killers of the three-pointers or two-pointers. Well, you may never go. One rebound, six assists, one steal. Only nine has 18 field goals. Four three-pointers remain, and he has 11 of them. That is a lot. 36 performance effort. What a finish. But it won't be hard enough until they get back to game two. And that's going to wrap it up here, folks. I hope you enjoy part of the day two of the NBA playoffs on 2K Sports of game one. We'll stick you around next time here for tomorrow night's game in between for the matchoffs between right in between the zone of the Magic and the Knicks. And for the other side, calling for all Nuggets and, and Warriors back again to see them real soon at 9.30 p.m. But for the pregame show, I will have Wood Spoonie. That will be happening here for with Gangs the Beast for the pregame show. For the first two games, and then the next two games, will be Terry Crews and Tyler Beast. That will be on the other side of it, in between, where right out of those two. As we have the Cavs facing against the Pacers, and the Mavericks against the Clippers. So that will be all for everything, and I hope you all enjoyed it too. Peace out folks for a while, as the NBA playoffs on 2K Sports Style. That concludes Game 1, we'll be back with Game 2. Son of Beast and Test Tube are out of here. Peace out for now. Good night and mile high. And see you all 
next game. If you don't, if you don't, somebody will.